Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of months, we have been talking a bit about Google Play games that you can now install on Windows 10 and Windows 11. And just to let you know that if you are using the app on um, Windows, that Google has recently rolled out a major update for Google Play Games beta on Windows 10 and Windows 11 PCs. And um, it is still in beta, so it's still in preview. But nonetheless, this um, is a major update. And if you are interested and are using the app on Windows, just to let you know about a couple of key highlights that was announced by Google with this version upgrade. Now, first of all, um, you can play now more than 3,000 games. And as you can see, that now includes a Clash of Clans and Clash Royale. So these were um, popular games on mobile, as many of you may know. So you can play those now from the convenience of your Windows 11 or Windows 10 device. And um, your progress also syncs across your different devices. So if you are playing on mobile or your Windows PC or your Chromebook, you can sync that across your different devices and your gameplay across those different devices, which I think is a nice move. So Clash of Clans and Clash Royale um, are included now where you can play more than 3,000 games now after this major version upgrade. Then something else is if we head over to the All Games section, you can see now that you can use Search to search for a game. So um, if you are wanting to find a relevant game or um, just do a quick search to find a particular game, then as you can see, that is now available. You are now able, able to quickly search for any game now in the app. And then something else uh, is that you can also now connect game controllers um, if you are using Google Play Games Beta. So if you have supported controllers, you can try out your Xbox 6, your Xbox One, PS5 DualSense or PS4 DualShock game controller with compatible games such as Asphalt 9, Legends and Badlands. So just take note of that. And then another nice move now is you can also now play in 4K. So um, if you have a supported monitor, um, you, uh, a lot of games now will be available in 4K. So um, you also have the option to select from a variety of screen resolutions that suit gameplay needs, says Google from that announcement. So you can just press shift and tab in any game to select from a menu of supported resolutions. So um, 4K is now available if you have a monitor that obviously supports 4K. Now, to have these um, upgrades, first of all, we need to just, just double check what the latest version is. So for that, we're going to head over to settings and the latest app version 23.10.697.1. So that's the latest version in bold to receive these new features we are talking about uh, in the video today. And something else just to take note of, um, there are a couple of minimum hardware requirements and specs that are required to run Google Play games on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So first of all, um, you need a solid state drive SSD with 10 gigabytes of available storage space. Uh, you need to be able to and be running Intel UHD graphics 630 GPU or a comparable graphics card. Um, you need a processor with four CPU physical cores because some games require an, and also some games require an Intel CPU and you need eight, gig, eight gigabytes of RAM. You obviously need a Windows admin account and hardware virtualization must be turned on. So just take note of those system requirements. So as an example, I can install the app on my Windows 11 device, but my Windows 10 device, unfortunately, does not have an SSD, so I cannot run Google Play games on my Windows 10 device. But nonetheless, just letting you know about that major update, bringing some uh, key uh, features now to Google Play games beta on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.